3505. It's the second floor rear unit. It's unique because it's super cozy. It's a one bedroom. It's a pretty good sized living room. It's probably a 10, 10 by 14, 10 by 16. So, got space for your Christmas tree, space for your TV, space for your couch, your table. And you're comfortable, you know? It's just good. Now, the best way to show you is to start in the kitchen. I was actually going to come in through this second back entrance. So you got this back entry for storage. Um, for you to, you know, store your stuff. Yeah, this is on net. If you want to let the breeze through. That's kind of cool. But, um, I was actually going to come in through this back door. Uh, to show you stuff from here. Okay, so here's your kitchen. You're gonna say that's small. It's not small because this is your kitchen with your cabinetry and just, you know, space to preparation. You got your stove here. It's present. It works. Uh, you're welcome to it. And then you just need the fridge. Now, right, uh, the next room is a good size dining room. Now, seeing as that this is a one bedroom, this is set up for, you know, some visitors and stuff, you know, so that's always nice. Like just cause you got a one bedroom, all my place is too small. This place got the extra space, you know. So you can put a table for four here. That's cool, they'll look attractive, place it right in the middle. Get it with the black and tan in it, with a throw rug, look pretty with that black and red throw rug. Ooh, Charlie. All right, so now, you come into the bedroom. Nice, overstock. Closet, this is overstock for your toiletries and things. And then you have your regular bedroom. Nice, nice. So from here to here is about 10 or 11. From there to there is about 12. So it's about 11 by 12. So you can put a good size bed right in the middle right here. Dresser up on this side. And here's your closet. You don't want to put no dresser on this side because your closet's here. So you do have a full-size closet, aside from your toiletries. It's spacious, ran LVP all the way through. So that's good, it's attractive. Nice size, again, freshly painted. I'm trying to get you guys to get the whole picture. I walk through because I don't want to forget what I'm going to say. So sometimes I think I'm walking too fast, but it's just that I'm just trying not to forget to tell you everything that's featured, you know? Like, I love the black cabinets. That looks hot, dude. So, uh, you come this way. And here's your bathroom. Game of Thrones, you know. I don't put too much weight on this because you only drop weight, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I understand that for a lot of people. It's very important. So, I got new tubs around. Gorgeous. And tub. Gorgeous. Look at that. New toilet. It looks good. Got tile. In all the right places, easy to clean, and all the places that are gonna get dirty is with food, and with wet, and with this, and with that. And then you got the LVP in the living, you know? So that's awesome. So, it's so a one bedroom, one bath, second floor rear unit. I think it's number three officially. If you see that in the listing, that's number three because it's a number three unit, but a second floor rear. Here we go now. Keep in mind, wherever you're finding this video, I need you to go back to our website at our vacancies page, buildgardvacancy.com. Find it through the filter. Filter out through the neighborhood, through bedroom count, through address, whatever you want. Find this same listing. Click on the set your own appointment. And then you set your own appointment. And then that's it. Uh, you'll have a real person. We're not gonna bottle you up and do a walkthrough with 50 people there to make you feel anxious and regret the rest of your time there. No, we wanna make sure you seek what you need, find what you need, and get what you need. So, um, you'll have a listening agent walking you through, answering your questions. Uh, most of the information, though, you'll find on your page, on your uh, on your listings, on the video, and the pictures. It'll give you 99% of 
general information, but they're always the unique stuff that a person has to ask or needs to know, and that's what she's there for. That's what she'll, she will get you that unique information or the answer for it. But, okay, let's get it.